Hi, I'm Donna Stanley with Endless Mountain Labradors, and today I want to answer some of the questions that people have been asking me about Life's Abundance Food, which we actually recommend to our clients. Uh, if you go to my website, emlabradors.com, that's E like an endless, M like in mountain, labradors.com, and click on the nutrition, health and nutrition button in the drop down, you'll see Life's Abundance, and you'll be able to learn a little more, and you know what I'm talking about. But I wanted to talk about a, a, a term that a lot I hear a lot of people using, and uh, it's called human grade and a lot of people in the dog food industry are using this word um, That it's human grade and so I spent some time talking to dr. Jane Bix about this uh, She's a veterinarian who actually formulated life's abundance dog food and she actually said, you know, you, you can't say this with dog food um, as as soon as the dog the ingredients that are going to be used for dog food hit the truck that leaves the human grade plant and goes to the factory where they're going to make it into dog food it's no longer human grade technically so we can't truly say that the federal trade commission actually doesn't even have this term at all from what she said and she said it is false and misleading so be careful when you hear that buzzword and and look into it a little more about what they're saying and why they're saying that um also some of the uh, the questions I've had are about certifications of the food. So um, it is AFCO approved. So that is one of the governing agencies that looks at dog food and says, does it have this, 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 this? Um, and you will see uh, if you look up, you know, AFCO and dog food, uh, foods will come up and it'll show you what kind of ingredients that they're regulating. Um, and so they police the dog food industry. They make sure that the label is actually um, accurate. So they may even spot check food. And I know that there's been some food lately that um, has been spot checked and found that the things that they were claiming were on their label were not in fact in there. And there was some class action lawsuits. Also the other certification that um, Life's Abundance has is uh, first of all, the USDA is involved in every single um, oversight of the ingredients. And um, there's agriculture departments, there's inspectors that go in and check um, and the equipment where the dog food's being made. They're, test they're testing it for bacteria, for cleanliness, sanitation. Um, they have a checklist that they go through with them. And then there's also um, something called APHIS. And this is a new one for me. And this particular... Um, group of people actually regulate the foods that are supplying foods or dog foods to the European community and if you've been in Europe you'll find out that they have a lot more stringent rules about food they are way ahead of us in fact when I was in Scotland last year they had made GMOs illegal and we were like yay you know that that's great we, we so wish that that would happen in the US and one of the things I want to make sure you know is that all the protein sources in Life's Abundance are all from small farms. They are not fed GMOs. The turkeys are free range. And uh, the lamb that comes in some of the treats and things is from New Zealand. And they're grass fed. So those ingredients are very important. But th the fact that we are checked by APHIS shows you that the standards are higher than the U.S. standards because they also are checking for foods, uh, the things that you, the Europeans would want to know about in the foods. So as far as certifications, that's just a little bit for you, but we had some questions about that regarding the Life's Abundance food and we wanted to address it. If you want to learn any more about that, you can always go to my website, emlabradors.com, it's E like in endless, M like in mountain, labradors.com. Click on the health and nutrition button at the top and you'll see the drop down menu. You can go to Life's Abundance. And there's also some blogs there that are more in depth and that Dr. Jane has written if you want to search a little farther. Um, so thanks so much for listening to this short video. I hope it helped you. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can get all the latest videos that come out. Thanks so much and have a great day.